I know it is really hard for you guys to stay on top of everything and make sure we haven't missed anything out, which is why I'm a big, big fan of checklists and to-do lists and something where I can just go through and tick everything off just always makes me feel better once I've done that. And I know for you guys it's really, really important to make sure you haven't missed any bit out because there's been so much in and out of school throughout your year 10, throughout your year 11, like bubbles popping, home learning, and sometimes it can all feel like it's just all a bit up in the air. So the brilliant people over at Pearson have come up with a fantastic way to help you catch up everything you need to catch up everything you missed in 2020 so that you are ready for the exams or external assessments or central assessed grades or however you're being assessed for your GCSEs this year and what they've done is they've sent me a load of stuff for you. So I'm going to show you the genius things that they have come up with and uh, then we're going to have a look at them. So as I said, I think checklists are brilliant and really, really important. So what they've done is these are tiny. They've got these tiny little checklists and what they're going to do is go through and just test each skill. So just do you know this? Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. And then because they're brilliant at keeping everything sorted and together, what they've done is put things where you need to go and look stuff up. And uh, this is one of the really nice things that I like about this, is that it's all synced up and coordinated. This is one of the advantages of having kind of like the, the origin guides and the workbooks written by the people that write the exams. It's just really, really well planned. So on your little checklists, we can say, look here, this one is about fractions. And if you don't know it, you need to go to page 47. The brilliant thing is when you then go to page 47 of the revision guide oh look there it is page 47 it's got that exact skill and then exactly the same page number in the workbook look here we are practicing that exact skill again it's just so seamless and well put together and Things like that just make your life easier at the moment. And literally anything we can do to make our lives easier at the moment is well worth doing. So something like just being given, being handed a nice little checklist of stuff you need to do, stuff you need to know, and it's not massive. So it's not hugely overwhelming. There's not like pages and pages and pages of stuff for you to like trawl through or print off because it is all here. And then you can just tick and cross and it tells you where to go to, to revise that, to learn that, to do the workbook questions on it, sort it out. So you don't have to put loads of effort into going to find stuff. You don't have to put loads of effort into going to like work out which bits do I need to go to, where do I need to find information, which questions do I need to go to do this, because they've done all that thinking for you. And at the moment, any thinking or anything that we can give to other people to do for us is definitely, definitely worth it. Making our lives as easy as possible so that we can try and get through this as happy and as healthy and having some as well in our exams as we possibly can is definitely, definitely worth it. Now, I am holding a massive chunk of books here. That's because Pearson have covered loads and loads of different bits. Now, like I said, Pearson and Excel, they are the people that write the exams, so they know what they are talking about. We've got maths, revision guide, and workbook for higher and foundations here. They also have it for science as well. So in the Catch Up 2020 pack, we can see you've got the knowledge checklist, the revision cards and the revision workbooks and loads and loads of things to help you. Now, I'm gonna test to see how efficient and organized they are. You can see the answers on the back there. I'm gonna pick a page, right. So if you got this question wrong, it says go to page 154. So in the revision guide, in theory, Let's test and see if this actually works. On page 154, 
calculating energy changes how nice is that everything laid out worked example telling you exactly what bit you need to do for where now if this is all synced up as i expect it is on the same page of the revision worksheet, page 154, where is it? Look at that, how beautiful is that? Page 154, loads of any questions about calculating energy change. So you can just have the books open, they're all there on the same pages, ready and waiting for you. So this is what the clever people at Pearson are doing to help you catch up everything that you have missed. In combination with the revision cards and the 10 minute tests and the workbooks, this is for maths and English and science and history and I've seen a few other subjects as well. So if you are doing an Excel, these are literally like absolute essentials for you to go and get.